in there. It only spoke to how good the win was for Heroic, but FaZe definitely still looked. They looked like that best team of the year from the first yeah, half did. of the year, 60% of the year. So we'll see if they can continue on here at the World Final and end strong. Because they have Brokey back. Mm -hmm. you know, started the year with spectacular form and was MVP of Fall Finals despite not winning the events. But uh, speak of him, and he will deliver. It's Monacy dead instantly. JKS traded back. Kerrigan activates in the squeaky push, but Nico is actually inside of Hut. Ooh, things could get weird here if they decide to come back because Nico's thinking, listen, it's all good. Hunter's a little bit more fixated about squeaky. Mm, and JKS wanted to come and clear it. Kerrigan won't get more than the one. Rain slides out from heaven. Gets cleaned out by Nico, and now that A site looks prime for the taking. Yeah. We got smoke on Mini, we got a Molly down in Vents, and it's gonna have to be Rops and Twists for the two versus three. And that's just because Nico took that lead inside of the hut, so Rain thought he could get to a better spot and stop them as they were coming out, but that was. It's a very nice attack. However, it's still a two-on-two. Two. Mm -hmm. It's getting pieced together at the moment. I don't know if we've got a kit down. I don't see it. And Twist spots one back sight. Hunter. Oh. Oh, Nico got it. Yeah. A uh, helping hand from his brother-in-arms. And Twist's chance now knows where they're at, but gets Ooh. smashed between the Kodak. See if that'll change things. We get Ooh, the fast. immediate pressure coming into this A sight. Good amount of utility damage, and oh, it goes unchecked. Oh, twists. Nearly a triple with just the MAC-10. Despite the pace of it all, it comes. The longer they wait, suddenly that clock ticking quickly. Brokey catches Hunter. Always good for one this spot. And Rops just throws himself at the follow-up. Beautiful couple kills out of Monacy. And Nico, with that lobby hold, ends up picking up a critical kill. Bomb's gonna sprint downstairs. Oh. Kerrigan could challenge from decon. Hooksy gets into the cover and Monacy is saving the day. Three kills in this Rops round. Rops and swinging big greens, but nobody swings it like Monacy. You know, no matter, oh wow, okay. Oh, that's a perfect trade. Yeah. That's perfect for the walkout. Nicely done, Hunter just takes the place of Hooksy, but Rops shows that second op, and Kerrigan just got man advantage back for FaZe, but he sticks out in the open. Tries to double down, and instead, JKS now trying to pressure into the A-site. Twist's chance to shine. He'll deliver the headshot. And now it's Monacy into the clutch. One versus two against Twists and Rops. Comes out from Hunt. Beautiful shot. Him versus Rops. Op versus Op. And the bomb down in the open. Rops spotted. Ooh. And that could have been him dead. That was a hip extending. Monacy, who has hit every other shot, gives Rops a chance to survive this one. He doesn't even want to hold the angle. He's actually respecting Monacy. Scared. And this is a spot where he can plant backside. He has to worry about heaven. Hops hasn't, Rops hasn't made the rotation. But Monacy knows he has the op, so I, I don't think he believes it's going to be heaven. And yeah, he oh, calls that out. Beautiful oh, oh. play from Monacy, man. That was <gasps> such a... going to try to find his path out from ramp. And Rops. Mm, down he goes. But again, right? We've seen these moments. We've seen these openings. Kerrigan finds that perfect timing and turns attention back. But Hunter's going to slide through with another trade outside. There's one here upstairs. Oh, nice headshot. It is. Costs Hunter two-thirds his health. Could prime Rops nicely, but damage still being done. Uh oh And Monacy's in another clutch. He's got the bomb on his back. He's got two players low. And he's got that X factor. 15 seconds. He can section off these fights. He could get the Rops kill first. But Rops gets around the corner. He hears the ladder step. Now his nose. He knows where all three oh, players oh, are. Oh, he oh. knows where all three players oh are. Oh my god, that oh shot was god. so fast. It was good for one. Will be again. Last time he jumped into the next fight. This time they'll come out and clear him. Rain's gonna work his way through hell. Twists committed to the back site. And where's Brokey gotten off to? Ah, still here on control. G2 kind of stutter step a second. Oh. JKS, one health left, but they don't know about twists. He peeks with the double. And the little bit that's left of JKS could still pull out a heroic moment, <laughs> but Rain's gonna lock it in of on. Of course, Fen phase back in with the guns, so. G2 could be proud of this half. Looking to finish it with a cherry on top. Twists is playing behind sight and slides out. Kerrigan tries to serve Hooksy. up the distraction, but it's Hooksy in with the double. 
Nico's got man advantage here for the side of G2, but it's a little HP for Hooksy and Nico. And obviously, final round of the half, so Rops and Brokey gonna try to see what sticks. We got a 1v1 outside. Nico can just buy time. And with Rops preoccupied, it is Brokey on his own through Mini first and foremost. And I love that from Nico. Drop the smoke, create a question mark, run over towards lobby. Mm -hmm. Now the utility is starting to pressure the retake. Monacy gets hit by the nade. Brokey comes through with a fast one. They're still worried about Nico outdoors. Brokey's pressing in, and Hooksy's on the backside of the site. Rops, oh, head comes off. Brokey picks up kills, but time is the decider. And it's not there for FaZe. Jeez. to be proud about. Obviously, I think some of the individuals at FaZe are also shining, but... G2 have done the hard part. Now, you can pull out your knives and sit and vent. Monacy and Co. try pushing up through Trophy. They've got three players pushing from ramp, plus the hut push, and Nico still sitting in the ramp. So Lobby belongs to the defense. Kerrigan has to fall out. Hooksy catches Brokey out on vent exit, and this wow. pistol's going swimming. He's running over him. Uh, and then backing up and driving over them twice. The only damage is pretty much that pre-fire from Kerrigan as they were like running into the lobby. That one headshot. Oh, and that Monacy, who was the guy who got gushed down to seven HP, wins his. Monacy could shred him unexpectedly. I like this setup a ton. I mean, especially with the outside control early. Yeah, they can double up here and they're in a really, really good spot. So JKS can even join in this late. It's gonna be hard to read the double push and he can pick it just a timing whenever he wants. And the thing is, if they leave, that's huge info, so... Oh! Oh, man, Kerrigan gets around the box. He's gonna clear it, though. Oh! Okay. Wow, that was close. That was an opportunity for Kerrigan, for sure. Leaves him on 13 health. They're gonna go test ramp. Nico. oh, gets bested by Twists, who's now left on a measly 7 HP. Kind of mirrors JKS's problematic situation. Deagle here for Hooksy. Oh, 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 oh. through smoke. It's like that. Dude, the overkill in that situation. JKS doing some good damage right there, too. And Hooksy back to the Deagle. Fire on his feet opens the door. Brokey's gonna plant that bomb. Nades go flying out, but they've got the post plant. And they've got JKS on 10 HP. Little bits of time left over. The first tap comes out. They're gonna go for the double peak. They get Hunter off of it. And JKS will not be able to get that defuse through, nor survive. We've got Robs and Brokey. The OD oh. reference. All right. Economic woes for G2, but who needs guns when you've got scouts? That's an opt down. <laughs> He just got smoked. And I love that he just wastes no time. Instantly outdoors, looking for something else. And you've got a guy on top. Oh, I hate this position. You hate this position so much. But it's so it good. Works. I literally play it nowadays. <laughs> because it just it always catches you off. <laughs> they never see it coming. So we get a scout kill and then an AK kill, right? The two weapons that G2 have to work with this round, and they've already found their success. Yeah, punch this outside. If you swing outside, obviously that spot is not as good because you can see them getting up there, but looks like the two perfect tactics mm -hmm. for the setup phase. And, ooh, no op that has been taken back. So Hooksy, he can hold on this very strong angle. Wow. Gobbles that up real quick. Got a little crazy with it right there, but it's still a 4v2. JKS, here's the movement forward. A site's gonna be nicely stacked. Heaven, site, hut, tough to get out if you're phase. But Hunter makes sure to drop bomb. Rops is back exposed and JKS is creeping in. A beautiful round out of G2 with only... Nico's gonna fall, so it's not all sunshine and rainbows. in the hands of Rain. Hunter coming forward is the best move right now. Nice. Hooksy gonna make sure that they can't get away with the weapons. Stop the bleeding right then and there, and a nice little secret push from Hunter ensures the fact. Brokey and Rops gonna try their absolute damnedest, but this armored Tech-9 and Lobby is so far removed from Bomb and the guns and the remaining three players that it's 15 G2, five map points. FaZe only half invested, so saving up to 
Fight back. All the way to OT, five rounds in a row. Maybe they can honestly very quickly back behind red, and the only thing here to stop him is rain. Oh, Nico opens up versus Rops. Rain kind of getting drawn towards Mini, but we've got bodies all over. And oh, Odyssey. Odyssey. Oh my god, he survives. Oh my god. Hooksy's gonna pressure in from ramp, loses out to twists. JKS trades, but we've got Bomb down in the backside. It's Brokey and Kerrigan to try and hold off versus four. Nico's up in heaven. They've got Mini. They've got flash support. And Kerrigan is so blind. Brokey's gonna have to do it all, pressured from both ends, and G2 pick up an opening map over FaZe here on Nuke. They've done it versus Heroic, they've done it versus FaZe. Ooh, Hunter, love this. Ah, uh, oh, love it. Wow. The chicken, it blocked the shot. It got in the way. You know, he really aimed for that one too, I just wanna say. It just, you know, there's chickens on Anubis as well. I think we need less. We got a five versus three out of phase as they have cleared out both Hunter and JKS without casualty. It's going to be a quick little push here from Monacy trying to get ahead of what was meant to be that short flash. But Hooksy kind of blinds everybody. And with it, it's looking like FaZe could pick up their first pistol in the series. Nico 1v5 or bust. And I bet bust. He'll kill Brokey at the very least. Rop's gonna find that pressure, and FaZe will find a pistol win. Oh, that's fast. That is fast. Kerrigan's a core player here on the T side. Just when he, he's always leading those arch wraps. So more than more than just a caller for sure. Info gatherer. Annoying for the team to lose early. Rain can be that other guy. Sometimes we'll go for the lurks here. Just lining up the silent drop outside of the back of the halls. Misses it. All good. Nice nade. Softens up twists perfectly. Nico. Oh, finds Brokey in the background. Is he worried about close too? Uh, I don't think so. I think he actually might. Oh! Uh, Nico, let's go. Three kills. Just off the mark with the wood wall bang. You want? Oh! oh, oh one more! Oh, the ace is oh. there, but Ross will take it away. Jesus! Hooksy finishes it off. What a tap! What a nasty, disgusting shot. So output excellent. Oh wow, the timings for Nico are just so nuts. He's got the, this funnel to the bottom of B where you know you cut people off. Ooh. Hunter. Yeah, with the flash. Kerrigan had a teammate watching it, but they had to peel off for a second. Man, feels and they like just keep coming forward. Feels like Nico's kind of finding this that This is a bit risky thing. for Hooksy, but oh, he wins his duel. Oh, bomb gets dropped, and then Nico's coming in behind him. I, I feel like the round wasn't over just yet, so, you know, there's still a chance here for FaZe for sure. Nico on the sandbag. Rain comes round. Head clean off. Nico gonna buy a little bit of time here, and it's Rops versus three. But so much damage done by Nico that you'd think it's too much to ask. Twelve health versus two. Front sight plant. They're gonna walk right through it. At least it's money here for base, but money's all they've got. Wasting no time jumping left and right. Get deep. I got lots of info here, man. They still have Monacy. On boiler, JKS watching the fall back. They can regress after the mall if they want to. Nice he goes flash. back. Flash works. Hooksy goes down on B. Okay. It might be inconsequential. Probably a better frag here for G2. Nico's still alive as well. And this position could easily catch twists. Oh. Wow. Twist just kind of presses already. along the side of the Molotov. I can see why that catches Nico off guard. So he loses his position, loses his control of banana. That's kind of exactly what FaZe were banking on. Yeah, we're kind of down to no nades here for the CT side, so. He's gonna try and press into the A site. These flashes can make the difference. Monacy, no. They wanna go here. He's, he's who they gotta take down. Looks like they could jump out behind him in this spot, which counters the setup pretty well. Ross might go mini though. Let's see. Yeah, there it is. Freebie. Here's the answer back from JK. Yes! Oh, nice Ooh. second kill. 
at least kind of makes up for the fact Monacy goes down empty-handed. But remember, Hunter down on 46, Nico tagged to three quarters. No smoke as well. They can't scale onto the A site. I don't know how, if they want to try this. Could take a chance. Could run the risk. It's versus Robson Brokey. Oh, they did have a smoke. Must one. have picked it up. Brokey gets flashed off his initial angle. Hunter's able to press into the bomb site, but remember, bomb planted four short. We've got a Molotov as well for Rops, and since they threw that smoke, nothing to actually extinguish it. If Brokey hits his shot, Whoa. if he had hit that shot, it could have been wonderful. Molotov basically guarantees this one, and Rops going to get picked up on his escape. So again, the price tag here is high, but it is phased to take a lead, six over five. What's the call? Follow through. Here we go. Heavy commitment. Monacy going to be smoked out. Nico relegated to the dark corner. And Kerrigan blinded as he rounds the edge. Easy goes. Nico, quick swap out. But there's the answer back. Monacy still alive. Overconfidence. Oh. Twist doesn't take the shot. I don't know. Did he see him? What happened? It looked like, it looked like he would have. Okay, this is weird. 30 seconds up, Monacy wants to press around. He catches Twists, won't be able to finish off Rops, who's now three kills deep in this round and only has to finish off the Aussie. But 32 health is all he'll have left. Seems to know, seems to expect Banana, but he's gotta grab that bomb. He made noise. No, he didn't. Oh, pff, nice JKS, shot. nice clean kill, insta headshot. Be than us. I feel like running that risk as well. They had to kind of keep Nico committed to it. Ooh, nice. Kerrigan. Wow. Three <laughs> kills versus guns. Oh, and he wanted Modesty added to the tally, but uh, the kid doesn't go down with ease. Rain will finish it off. Three survive here for FaZe. Nico might be trying to feed into their fear that it's going to be B, or their excitement, in fact. Rops not taking a deep angle, so. Ooh, point blank, just good for one. Great trade. Now the smoke down a moto means broke just out of the round for now. Oh, well, I was, no, just kidding. The nasty little tap onto Nico. The, the retake is on. I feel like this could come down to JKS. He's got the USP in pit, right? We got a nade on twists. Armored Berettas with a nade. Rain's got a flash as well to try to get this going, but we've got no kit on the CT side. Hunter going down for free is great for FaZe, but JKS only the singular kill on the answer, ooh, 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 ooh. and they'll make that retake happen with Here time. The finals. And they would go up against outsiders for elimination. That oh, collateral. At the same time, Kerrigan and Rain lined up, knocked out. And if they think that's an open B site, oh, they're wrong. Twists. Tries to find a lineup. JKS catches a kill at that A site in the meantime. And Twist just peels away from this because it's numbers G2 pressing into B. Collateral kill from Nico to get a rifle round win over FaZe. How they line up right there in front of car? Uh, and was it an op in the back? No, Brokey was on the other side of the map. Oh, look at the distance yeah. between them. The two deaths Half on the data. In. Yeah, wow. Oh, true. JKS today, is something, yeah. Today it's up there, right? We uh, Excellent pit play out of that A defense here on Inferno. Rain's going to catch Hooksy. They're going to try to press the issue. And Kerrigan, well, he lines up a third kill here for FaZe. Because Rain gets a second one right before he dies. So, again, we can talk about G2O all we want. This map's not over. And the B defense holds strong this time. Yeah. For the time. Again. Molly. That could be Kerrigan dead. Then it's going to have to be Twists. And honestly, Twists... Six kills across this map could drop the ball versus the likes of JKS. If he shoulders it properly. And even if the trade comes out from Monacy, I've seen a Monacy 1v3 on this very site. Oh, oh, we did. And he slides right out, predicts the deep position, and a double flank now prime to try and bring this back. He smoked the flank. Holy hell. It's not a good smoke, though. There's a gap around it. I know where Monacy is, but he's watching. Ready for that first peek, and then there's this kind of you know, gap. Oh, but Ross, quick headshot. Oh, and Brokey makes sure to finish. It's going to be Kerrigan tested here on Arch in a second. Not to mention Brokey's support gets smoked off. Kerrigan first kills clean. We get the push along the wall from Hunter. Blinded, he finishes off Brokey. And there's still a chance that Short could collapse. Twists. When? If ever. 
trying to fall back ever so slightly, sees the shadow and doesn't want to push the issue. Rops knows what's coming. Nico versus Kerrigan, insta headshot over on Arch. And now it could be the Apps player to get the trade back on Rops. Nice clean one out of JKS, yet again twists in an instrumental position. But where have they gone? Where will they go? Bomb dropped on short. Rain tries to throw himself at this. JKS needs to double back around, and time becomes a problem. Let's see if he takes a peek, actually, JKS. Twist catches Nico. Oh, the timing. Wow. Nasty. We're all tied up again. 11 all. Well, Faze gambling this. Bomb going back to B, however. Looking for the coffin's flash. It could be just for the audible. I don't know if they're pushing off this rain. Ready in the swing? Not seeing anything. But they're right there. Yeah, they are. All of them. Oh, caught oh, the jump. They were so silent. He thought there was just nothing there. Smoke down. Nade at the feet of Kerrigan. Still has a good amount of health, but his smoke is buns. Modesty and Hooksy tagged up heavy. This could prime Twists perfectly. And he's got a freebie versus the bomb plant. Twists with a chance to shine. Three kills off of the new box. Finally, a round he can be proud of. Yeah, so clean with it. It was a slow map for him, but... Here he is, the twist from Nuke that we saw earlier on. And now Hunter in the 1v2. 20 seconds, I mean, it's not impossible. He's got a one way here. Twist goes down, smoke up. No shots in, nothing on the cross. Health advantage. Really Brokey, he's not coming through yet, but as soon as he hears it plant. <gasps> oh my God, he's oh. winning. No way, Hunter pulls out the clutch. At the very, very end, but we got four players stacked up on short. We get an insta kill out of Kerrigan. He invites them to push in. Brokey gets the one. We've got the bomb dropped down on short, and there comes in from Twists. Again, they're gonna fight tooth and nail to try and hold on to bomb. And it's substantial damage oh. back both ways with nades. And what do you know? This time, FaZe, well, they've delivered, but they've pushed Monacy into a moment where he could shine, and the lesser weapons prevail. What goes Just two rifles to go up against. He's got decimated now. 14 to 12 for their opponents. Oh, but, but Brokey goes down. That's an arch player this quickly. However, twist in this position. Jets it. Okay, yeah. A little labored for a second. Rops tucked down in great. Oh, what a JKS shot from JKS. From apps. Ready for the peak. And JKS with another through the smoke. It is never over until it's over. And G2 off a hooksy entry. Collapse that A site defense Goddamn. right back to square one. However, phase because they won that on an eco sandbags, if they want to approach B, if they don't use anything, okay, yeah, they're setting up now. Nico sent around. Oh, Brokey missed the shot. Yeah, he, well, he got blinded and then he came out and tried to help, but oh. Rain ate that. Excellent flashbang for Nico to maximize that moment with. Can they set up Ross? He's been the king. Whoa, three kills in an instant. Oh, they exploded on mid. Everybody died. Bomb gets dropped. Brokey still with a slim chance, but now taken down to 59 and surrounded. So Bomb will be grabbed in a moment. Oh, -hoo 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 -hoo. Brokey just continues to fight and survive. And as he swaps out to the AK, again, they're all around him. And that... And Brokey knows he has to fight. He has to fight his way out, and he won't be able to. 14 all. Wow, three up here for G2. All five place players go down. Oh, God. Hook, line, and sinker, unless, unless Rops, who has kept them in this, goes big. Brokey, oh, he finds that first one, sets Rops up for the next. Brokey, missed shot, dive sight, and JKS again with a double kill. Here comes Twist with one kill back. A 2v2 to close this. 20 seconds, Bomb crosses in the hands of Monacy. Kerrigan's gonna take the apartment's wrap, and Bomb will go down uncontested. Oh, they have a late moto smoke as well. JKS in pit. Comes down to Kerrigan here, he's up in halls. This is where he delivered on his CT half, and it's where he's looking to lock it in, but Kerrigan finds the headshot. Monacy back from sight is dead. Round 30 to phase, and we go OT. Okay. What? Phase got eco on the second round. G2 got eco when they could have won, basically, when it was 12-10. Oh, but Nico, he's been getting better and better. But what if they go too fast? <gasps> what if they go too fast? Rops with a double kill out of the boiler. Brokey's dead already. Twists, not going to be able to stop Hunter from rapping, but he could stop JKS on short. Oh, but the hops into the bomb site will save him. And there's Nico's impact catching Rain's flank. They know exactly where Twists is. Wow. There's a little time here, but so many open spots. Twist sees nothing. This retake will not be easy. 
We've seen this setup before with Brokey. And he finds his pick. Reigns pressed in. Nice flash from JKS. Instant execution out of Hooksy. They saw the CT peak. Oh, and he snaps it up into Kerrigan. Double kill out of Hooksy. Brokey trying to hold on for dear life. And a miss no scope leaves him exposed. He continues to press his luck. He continues to press through smoke. And he catches Monacy post plant, but Hunter burns him. And with Hunter down to 42, we're gonna get this Rops retake around from Banana. He needs to maybe find a rifle. There's gonna be corpses on the way in. Oh, he's playing oranges. They're not coming through construction, however, so JKS's spot is particularly strong right now. There's an M4 if he wants it. Rop swaps out. He's got utility. They start to press in. Oh. Twists. There's the trade. Rops brings it back. Justify Brokey coming over, but he might not get there in time. Oh god, Brain falls off of Orange. Nico not gonna find an opening kill this time, but maybe his cousin can. Hunter presses into the tree. Oh, Brokey. Oh, God. Oh, God. He's gonna take his kill as JKS finds Rain. Kerrigan on an aisle, surrounded and finding damage through the smoke. JKS tries to pressure this. He gets headshot. Rops quickly on the flank, but by the time he gets in, it's phase with fade. Ooh, this twist with an aid in hand. Go, but it might be the right one. Underhands the flash. Predicts the walkout from twists. He's gonna get that man advantage back and a little damage onto Kerrigan. Not to mention that would have been bomb spotted on its way, working up towards mid. Nice shot from Monacy. Gets away, holds it off. Second one is his, but can Brokey find his double? JKS pressed into the box, loses it to Kerrigan. And now it's the Kovac versus Brokey and Kerrigan. A two versus two as Nico comes sprinting through CT spawn. Brokey can keep this fixated over on short, and Hunter's gonna take the wraparound through the apartments. Kits on both CTs, no other nades for them to work with. Flashes for Brokey inside of the pit. Kerrigan back sight holds. They've got this pinch lined up. Can they get the kills? Brokey's pressured, has to hide, has to keep this tucked. That allows Nico to fixate on Kerrigan, and now they've got Brokey pinned. P250 for that first, and with a kit on Nico's back, he jumps on top of Bomb. He's got the time for the defuse. G2, 17. Oh. Ooh, denied the clutch. What a game. What a fight from G2 to take this BO3 win for Hooksy who can't manage to hang off on the logs. Brokey gonna finish off the little that was left of Nico with the util, and it's man advantage phase as they gun for 18. Yeah. Well, with Hunter in the spot, he can actually find out if they're if they're bluffing B, and it looks like they are. So two players on A kind of have full info, even though they've got four players coming towards them, and Hunter is on this flank. Back's turned. Yeah. Hunter could find huge timing, but they actually get ahead. They managed to round that corner right into Monacy. There's an eventual Rops wrap, but he's more worried about the CT rotate, which means Hunter, he's still ready, but oh, Brokey turns attention back. Oh my god, now they have the way to lock them into the A site, go back. It'd be crazy if he found this, honestly. Yeah, and you can see him trying to keep ahead on a swivel. Oh, okay. You better not miss. Rops is gonna find it. JKS knows that this problem of Rops is difficult to deal with. 31 kills. Oh, real quick. Kerrigan getting rowdy. Hunter's dropped Whoa. to 13. Immense nade on rain. And all of a sudden, FaZe trying to rush the issue. Kind of left limping in, but... Trying to punch that lurk as well. Oh, he gets extinguished. It's not just rain that's low. Hunter, Nico also wounded, but nades out here for rain. That's a freebie for Hooksy. And a frag destined for Brokey. That's him down to only 40, and they're gonna have to turn tail back. Rops comes out from Boiler, keeps this interesting. Monacy deleted. That's gonna keep Hooksy preoccupied with Arch. It all falls down to Nico like, at B. Yeah, they're like encouraged to search back mid, but JKS tucked in the cold. They're not in a position to do that. So now Nico, yeah, there's tons of emphasis on him. Nico versus three, doesn't play the site. Wants to press in, but Brokey's posted. And Brokey's not gonna miss that chance to strike him down at B. Hooksy's gonna have to run over. Can Hooksy actually stop this? Hello? Oh my god, again caught. That could have been a kill. If his M4's ready, that op shot missed, he could have taken a duel. 
Instead, it's him versus Rops. He hits the headshot, but Rops gets the kill. And now the 13 health left on Hunter, the 100 on JKS. It's such little HP for Brokey, and Rops can twist, prime himself, or will he even be needed? Phase surviving a test on Inferno. JKS goes down, and Phase will push this series to Ancient. Think you've been fighting really hard today. Oh, oh, oh. nice little freebie for Rops times two. Rain comes out from Cave. Brokey down from Ramp. This round might be one of them. Yeah, with guns, of course. Rops diving into cover. Util support in front of him. Twists picks up the nade kill. And we got more frags being chucked out all over. Bomb plant was attempted and cut out by Brokey. Comes through with some smoke spam and now things get a little weird. We've already got Kerrigan breathing down their neck in a main JK. They could push to CT actually. I mean, some weird options now that they get the bomb back, but they don't get the kills and Kerrigan activates. Yeah. You know, Twist and Rops were low that entire time. The next two players to take fights, Rain and Kerrigan, they're also now 46 and 19 HP. That's four close kills, but none of them come to fruition for G2. And at least that one had a little life on it. It's Nico's first two kills of the map, waiting for Monacy and Hunter and Hooksy to get online. Ooh, nice, wow. Nico. It's going to leave him on only 4 HP, but a clean press into Kerrigan. No smoke for Cave, and Rain reveals himself, so we've got two players in here. Oh, missed shot, but oh. luckily Rain gives cover. Brokey's barely alive. Twists has been caught by Hunter in mid, and now Rops takes the place of his fallen comrade. JKS going to be watching the A main push. That's a freebie for Rops. But a bomb plant down on B in the meanwhile. Brokey catches Hunter, who had left middle. Tried to go for that long wrap through T. And now the smokes on short block off Hooksy. Both teams essentially swapping sides of the bomb site. Making sound on the cross. Hooksy trying to piece together the bigger picture. Rain kills his teammate. Woo -hoo -hoo. Brokey no with the point blank no scope <laughs> to give FaZe gaps slash spams slash gimmicks inside of cave kerrigan swinging the arm oh, don't let hunter get his hands on that nico and hooksy both dead very clean couple of kills out of kerrigan That's six dope. and two off to the races monoseal catch twists and it's three from kerrigan in a gun round just cleaning up shop inside that site brokey drops bomb and while hunter has this a site under wraps it's looking like Got a Nico versus Brokey moment. Miss shot. Brokey on the corner. Gets his second one in. That's Nico out of the round. Molotov into the donut. He's gonna fluster rain. Twists insta headshot onto Hunter. 5v3 coming out for FaZe Clan. Oh, he's been shoulder to shoulder with another rifler offer almost every single kill, it feels like. Nice lurk out from Hooksy, though. This could catch him. Sure enough, his first kill. Looking to take the round into his own hands. And JKS has pushed through red. Kerrigan meant to get caught off. And it's traded right back by Brokey. Hot swap into the arm. Twist, spam, smoke. And Brokey won't overplay CT. Good call, because Monacy's looking for that kill. And Rain instead climbing the flank. Bomb plant will be committed to. Monacy falling backwards is going to fall right into Rain. Unsuspecting victim, Hooksy's gonna have to come up with the clutch. He's the reason they got into this A site, but is he the reason they hold on? Three players here, and Brokey insta kill for phases instant eight. JKS. But Rops, yeah, doesn't see enough towards middle. And because phase had leaned towards B, it looked like they were coming back, but now still a bit of back and forth hesitation. Rops, nasty angle on the signpost. Drops an incendiary frag to follow suit, but drive-by tech nine from Hunter. That's a second weapon offered over. Twist Ooh. now swinging the big green as he's on a quarter HP. Monacy hands busy with the plant. Rain's got a problem as Hunter's press close smoke. And that is an open door now. G2 even, 2v2, 
And Twist looks for another kill. Sees the head over the box. Brokey's right in front. And now it's gotta be Twist to come in big with the USP of all things. Modesty finds their first. Oh, yeah. No, Hooksy's still very much awake after that one round. Kept the energy going. Oh, I think his teammates. Oh, no, he's not. Wow. 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 Instant kill. It's a pre-fire, but it's beautiful. It's like yeah, it felt like it was a little too late on the smoke. Felt like he didn't throw it the first time. Yeah. Could have cost him, but nope. Twist picks it up. Nico tries to threaten this Whoa. B site, and honestly, he's puffed his chest big enough. And Twist sits in smoke. There's no one here on the A site at all. No one's in CT spawn. Hooksy's taking full control of this, and there are two ops to retake, which is not the most fun situation. Not ideal. It is quite a retakeable spot. They're going for their big flank, which they normally have been doing, getting away with. It's just that there's this double man advantage, and right now, honestly, still back turn. We'll see how he plays it. Right. At what point does they suspect that A play? Hunter now gonna be tasked with holding it. They've gone two inside of Temple, deep CT control, and if Hunter can hold on this spot, this is a winnable round. Rain comes out, not expecting this position from Hunter, so freebie of a kill, and now we're evened out. That double man advantage dissipates. Kerrigan gonna pressure the bomb site. Bomb ticking quick. Hunter grabs another. Rops has got the trade on Hooksy. But again, you need this defuse. And G2, 3v5, walk into an open site and take away a second. Yeah, it was just Nico over on. Hooksy, but Rain. Oof. Nico's over there. Dangerous jiggle. Nico loves these kinds of games. <laughs> just yeah, catch right. him. He knows he's holding a smoke. Yeah. He's waiting for an opportunity to come in, flip some wings. But down goes Hooksy. Looks like he tried to press up the ramp. Meanwhile, Nico applying this cave pressure. He's got an open line on site. He's got rain dead to rights. They know Kerrigan's on the other side of that pillar as well, so now Kerrigan's going to feel the pressure. He's got Brokey to try and help him, but a missed op shot, and Kerrigan's going to get stampeded. Yeah. Nico's been able to scale. I mean, he got in the cave. He's really close up. Kerrigan slides that back to the wall. Brokey gets smoked out. Shots missed. Kerrigan ready for the next one. Can't manage to hold on any longer. Too many bodies to come at this. And that well-placed smoke denied Brokey any attempt at holding off on cave. Nico pressing through. And we've got this rotate from Rop, so he's honed in. Allows for Brokey to keep eyes on sight. And now JKS has to stave off versus the double op and twists inside of Cave. But that's not going to happen. Three up from FaZe, 10-2 their lead. Full focus, fast win. Gonna try to press through. Bombardment with utility primes twists for an easy 2K. Blink and you'll miss it. Mid belongs to FaZe. Nico will get back on Cave. Kerrigan wow. pressing down the ramp. Again, the double headshots. And this is a stunned G2. I hope that they are fine letting the teams come fast at them. Yeah, yeah, right. yeah, the last oh, kill going down. But that just opens up a timing here for FaZe to press out on ramp. Nico doing his thing. Easy pickup for Brokey, but that would have been two players spotted, I presume. Twists insta rotation back towards the A site. Brokey's gonna try to pick up the gap in mid. Rain comes off of the peak from lane, and now it's man advantage. So four versus five turned into the four versus three. Yeah. And they go towards Robs. No, not the auto. No. No. Don't do it to him. I think they I think you should. No. Yeah. Don't. Poor Monas. He's only a teenager. Oh, now they know. Twists. It's a one and done. And there's the temple peak from Rops. Oh, it's over. 13-2 for you. One of two things. Either a very quick and easy close from FaZe to reassert some dominance, or the greatest G2 comeback you've ever seen. Pistol could decide. Right now, we've got Nico cleared out of A main. It's Rops and Brokey with kills apiece, and Hooksy on the double attempt. Shut out by Rops. Hunter tries to slide out. We've got busy hands, and it's great coverage offered by Rops, pushing Justin Savage into a nasty 1v4. Daunting task. Rops faces him, executes him. <laughs> Those aren't the ultimate. <laughs> okay, but, you know, all you need is a deeg.
co-signed by Nico. That's one way to start it off. And honestly lands the scout shot as well, so it's never over till it's over. Just playing absolute hard mode. Bomb gets picked back up. It's Rain and Brokey versus the world. And the spray gets away, so now it's all on rain. 1v5 with a bomb plant in front of him. Could get a couple kills here. First one's nice and clean. Nobody to wrap him from behind. It's going to be two on ramp, two on sight. Oh my oh, god, he gets him off the defuse. But the fire burns him back, and then the wrap around from Hooksy. So there's a little life left on G2, sure enough. Oh, nasty play from Kerrigan, pressing into the side of the smoke. Because Hunter is going to be happy. Okay, none of that. JKS goes down, and so a site could start to crumble. Rops is going to find the bomb plant as Brokey goes deep. Oh, this is a oh. nasty push. Oh, he doesn't get past the angle, but he's got a teammate right behind him. Yep. No, they could circumvent it. They have, they don't know about this stuff. Monacy gets away with his life, and they still don't know about Rain's peak. So that should be what's up next. But Brokey, no help needed. Just both kills. Monacy and Nico are dead. And with that, we've got Hooksy and Hunter just trying to hold on to their guns as they will attempt an 11 round comeback for OT. I'm not feeling it. Terrorists win. It's the baggage where the frustration lies. There we go. Opening kill. It's a good way to kick it off. Hooksy takes it into his own hands, but... Oh, he doesn't even know. Oh, my God. He doesn't get the gun. <laughs> Rain doesn't see it. Wait, wait, wait a second. And now Hooksy's got this, like, false sense oh, of confidence. What is happening? But Rain didn't shoot. Wait, he didn't get a gun. He went back with what? a gun and can't pick it up. And now Nico has to go back with him to get the gun. And now Nico dies. Nico dies. Oh, Nico's pissed. And Hooksy's Hooksy spotted... Hooksy was spotted too, right? Yeah, right. Yeah. If he's thinking that, oh, they don't know about me, he's in for a sad reality check. Of course, he needs help to get out of here. Rain's position's committed. There's no cave fight coming at him. Hunter's in the bomb site. Brokey's on full alert. Oh, I might have been spotted again. No, nope, maybe not. Now they for sure know that he's out <laughs> here, and Hooksy going to fight every step of the way. Twist picks up the kill. It's him and Rops in a two versus four. Turn two v three. JKS has the lesser weapon, but Twist is kind of running over rambunctiously, haphazardly, and timing could play into JKS's favor. Could. Uh, could, but look, Ross might get a kill right now. Easy. Insta execution. That allows for Twist to oh, sprint. Oh, man. No. Uh, this flank has just been nullified. It's just a regular. Oh, God. It's 2v4. Play. Let's see. JKS. This is open. It's planted opposite default, though, right? Back for CG. Doesn't challenge, doesn't stop it. Now he's spotted. And with this, Twists and Rops have ripped away the dream of G2. What could have been their 2-0 is now just another missed opportunity. Yes, they won Nuke versus Heroic.